When I was willing to take my own life, I remember thinking that if you're ready to do that, you must be you must be open to changing everything about yourself. At 19, I had my first panic attack uh, and my life was just, it was, it completely changed overnight. Um, I went from being this outdoorsy, adventurous, outgoing guy to being confined to my bedroom and just struggling not to hyperventilate. This escalated the bad relationship I had with my mum and unfortunately she, she couldn't cope anymore so she asked me to leave. Between sofa surfing and sleeping rough, I really lost myself to my mental illness. Um, not having a home or a safe place to go to at night is terrifying, but the hardest thing for me is to not have a safe place that is away from my mind. Art is the only thing that brings that to me. It brings me peace. My practice describes the realities of living with a mental illness and offers an insight into the day-to-day -day kind of realities that that brings. I started using art as a tool as my own self-therapy when I was put on a waiting list and told I had to wait over two years to get actual therapy. Art's not only saved my life, it's given me a purpose and a voice. Um, it's empowered me to share my journey with other people in the hopes that it can inspire others too. I've been given a space to exhibit in the Monica Arts Fair in New York. This is not only a life-changing opportunity for me, I mean it's amazing, but it's also, it's going to give me such a boost to share my story and build a platform from that which will help other people. When I was willing to take my own life, I remember thinking that if you're ready to do that, you must be open to changing everything about yourself. Um, I remember on my last attempt really thinking about this for hours. Um, and I decided that if I couldn't find happiness within myself, I would dedicate my life to helping others and finding happiness through that. Um, so shortly after that, that I started using art as a way to empower other people and encourage them to, to do something for themselves, whether it's through art or just being creative and just taking control of their own mental health as opposed to just waiting for a system that just puts you on a waiting list.